All right, hi you guys. So I'm doing um, writing tip number three. And this week I actually really want to ask you to focus on classic literature. I think as writers and editors, we just get a little bit caught up in the modern times of Facebook and magazines and periodicals and how quick we can read things online. But I would really encourage you to um, find your way back to classic literature. And the classic literature that I'm referring to is like Oscar Wilde, Henry Miller, Tolstoy, Faulkner, D.H. Lawrence, Langston Hughes, um, Anais Nin, Jane Austen, Shakespeare, of course, um, even Oscar, I think I said Oscar Wilde. If I mention him twice, it's because I'm a big fan. Um, even some C.S. Lewis, uh, and of course Tolkien, things that are just a little bit outside of your everyday pieces of literature. Why? Because the stories and provocations and truly beautiful use of vocabulary and the elemental foundations behind everything that they wrote is very, very crucial, and that's why it stood the test of time. And as a writer, you should be really concerned with the pieces of work that have stood the test of time. So I would recommend that. I also want to encourage you to read um, Franz Kafka's The Metamorphosis. It will take you to a place that is just unlike anything else. Um, and then of some more modern books that I would suggest reading, the, the most important thing that I want to say before I even do that is that all writers tend to write, and we get a little stuck in that mode, and we forget to be well-read. And a good writer is well read. So make sure you read all of these books. Um, the Alchemist is an excellent modern day fable. Um, so is Like Water for Chocolate. These are stories that are just very colorful and vibrant in texture and life and vivacity. And they just really bring something, bring something to the page that is very hard to find now. And I want all of us to have some sustainability in the long run. So that's my goal. And the other thing I want to ask you to do is write five pages of what writing means to you. Five pages. So you have a week to do this. Make sure that you contact me, email me. If you have any questions at all or anything that you're curious about, make sure that you get in touch. So um, A Taste of Dawn on Twitter, A Taste of Dawn, A-T-O-D on Facebook. So that's A Taste of Dawn, A Todd on Facebook. Instagram is Dawn Garcia or A Taste of Dawn. Um, but for me directly, do it Dawn Garcia. And you guys are welcome to email me, like I said, at contact at atodmagazine.com. Or just send me messages here on YouTube and I will make sure I get back to you. So happy writing. Go read up on the classics. Brush up on your vocabulary. And really delve into what you're doing and why you're doing it. Okay? Have a really great week and happy writing, you guys. Bye.